listen, yeah. Now someone else is getting all your best. Jeff Foxworthy. Oh my God, yes! Jeff Foxworthy. That's just what they'll do. One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over you. Eagle, we're sorry you are going home. But we are super excited to see who you really are. But first, panel, my gang, any guesses of whose famous face is about to be revealed? This was a tough one for yeah, us. tough one. I have no idea. I'm kind of just stuck on the listening to people's stories, finally telling my own. So that makes me think of a talk show host, a radio host. I came up with Howard Stern. Then the other side of me said Adam Carolla. I am so lost, but if I'm going to throw it out there, I'm just going to say Adam Carolla. I, I agree. There's a few things that, that stand out, like the, uh, you know, had a recent health scare, listen to people's stories, has a rock star type of personality. Howard Stern is definitely one of those kind of people and recently went through a health scare. And then, and then I thought Montel Williams, who was also a talk show host, who recently struggled with MS, but because of the height and the rock star, yeah. I'm going to go Howard Stern. Wow. Ken, you look like a mastermind. You're like an evil villain up there. He like, is. You know exactly who this is. It, it really, just trying to put all the clues together, obviously a talk show host with a great stage presence, great charisma, someone who's really got incredible comedic chops. I'm just going to have to double down on Craig Ferguson. She's doubling down. On the Scottish why, man. Why would a Scottish man pick an American eagle? <laughs> <laughs> will, you, will you just shut your hole, Robin? <laughs> Ms. Scherzinger. I, first, going off of the obvious, the red bandana and a health scare and the classic rock vibes. I was thinking Brett Michaels from Poison. Rock on, Eagle. But then on the SmackDown, the tone changed a little. It did change. And I was feeling Jeff Foxworthy, which isn't bad. Not a bad guess. Studies show most people in bandanas are named Jeff. That's a yeah. medical fact. The medical fact from the fact doctor. Guys. <laughs> and, and Eagle, you're welcome to give any of these guys the bird. That's all. Just uh, <laughs> we needed one more pun. Thank you, thank you, thank you. OK, panel, you've made your final guesses. Now let's see if any of you are right. And I'm dying to know who this is. Eagle, show us who you really are. Didn't see that coming at all. I did not see this coming at all. I was so close. I know. I was so close. You've spent a lot of your career talking to rock stars, helping them out. How did it feel to finally become a rock star on stage? Very bizarre. <laughs> We're doctors, man. Ken, how about you used to fill in for me? I filled in for you on Love Line. You but did. how about Jenny getting Adam Carolla? I, I know. And not, so you got so I close. I so close. So I actually thought Loveline, Adam Carolla, I never thought Dr. Drew's is like a rock and roll performer. <laughs> there he is! There he is! You are so sexy, Drew. Yeah. I'm serious. You look amazing. Well, you should have put me through. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. The artist formerly known as the Eagle, Dr. Drew! I would do anything for this, anything you've been dreaming of. But I just won't.